This vehicle has 402 sensors. One of them's located right here in front of the motor. There's another one up top. And there's two in the back, one down below, and then also another one further up. For this video, we're gonna replace this O2 sensor, but the procedure will be the same for the other ones. Disconnect the connector right here. There's a little lock tab here. You just gotta pull that out. Slide that out right there. That should be connected. And right on the connector, just pull up on this little lock and slide it out. And there's a wire tie right here. You can cut that. And just slide that out. Use a 7 8 wrench, or you can use an O2 sensor socket. And loosen it up. And take the O2 sensor out. Just slide it out. Take the new O2 sensor, get the thread started. Snug that up. If you have the ability to torque this, you want to torque it to 31 inch pounds. That's good. Now plug the connector in, just line it up and lock it down. Take that lock retainer and slide that back in position. Take the wires, you want to wrap them up a little bit. And if you have a wire tie that has the little stud on it, push it into the block, you can do that, or just use a wire tie. Just wrap it around. Just make sure the wires are out of the way. and trim the excess. 